Hello everyone, welcome to Up Close and Personal. I'm your host Sadia Khalidhi. Today we have a very special Indian actor with us. He has been acting for more than a quarter of a century and uh, his latest film Dial 100 is coming out on Z5 on August 6th. So we have with us Monuj Bajpayee. How are you today? Very well, Sadia. How are you? I hope you are staying safe and you are good. <laughs> yes, yes, we are, we are staying safe. So in Dial 100, you play a police officer who receives a distress call from a woman who has some unresolved personal issues with your character. And can you tell us anything about why this woman is kidnapping your family all of a sudden? Oh, that for that, you'll have to watch the film. You know, that I can't tell you because it a story happens in one night and this whole thriller uh, and the story takes place uh, in one night. By the time it's morning, Nikhil Sood, who is the, the father and the husband, his life completely changes uh, uh, in one night. Uh, so what is the story? What happens in the night is something that people will have to watch. Uh, my character, Nikhil Sood, he's a middle class person. He's somebody who doesn't care about uh, how his, uh, what his son is doing, uh, how his wife is managing at home. He's only interested in going to the job and, you know, staying there. And how one call from a woman, a strange woman, changes his complete life is the film all about. So I would request all the, all the Dhaka people, Bangladesh people, you know, through you, I will request them to watch the film and send your responses, send your opinion. Okay, we'll do that. Uh, so this scary woman is, pay, is played by Nina Gupta. So was she really scary as a villain? Oh, no, no, she's such a lovely girl. <laughs> she's such a lovely woman. I mean, uh, she's been our inspiration. She's, she's, uh, she's, for so many years, she's been proving herself uh, and she has given some tremendous performances over the years, very inspiring life she has led and she's been an inspiration for me and my family it was a privilege to share screen space with her um, similarly with uh, sakshi tanwar another fantastic actor she has uh, done some great stuff in cinema on tv and uh, she started her acting from my play when uh, you know when i directed her in her college a play i directed in, in her college she played the lead uh, and that was her first job as an actor. So I, I, I feel so proud, you know, looking at her on all the things that she has achieved in life. Wow. So uh, you're known for playing versatile characters and um, you've played uh, law enforcement personnel before. So did this character challenge you in any way? Oh, yes, it's very challenging. I mean, playing a character who is talking on the phone, you know, trying to deal with a very, you know, uh, uh, dangerous situation on the phone and it's a story of one night so to keep the emotional continuity uh, in the entire film was quite a quite a task because you know it happens in one night and then you are shooting the scene number 20 first scene number one after that then scene number 40 then scene number 50 so keeping the emotional graph of uh, of this character and the film was such a challenging job. It really tasted all my skill. Oh, wow. So this film um, boasts of a stellar cast, um, yet it doesn't have to rely on, you know, the, the typical Bollywood elements like glamour or fight scenes or item songs. Do you think that Bollywood landscape is slowly shifting towards that direction? Oh, yes, it, it has, you know, the big, all, OTT has been, you know, I have, I've, has been doing well since few years, five, five, six years, seven years, six years actually, not more than that. Uh, but uh, now, uh, you know, at the last season, the first season of Family Man has done extremely well. And uh, the second season came during the pandemic. Uh, you know, now in the lockdown, it has become the fourth most popular in the world. And with all this, you see the contents and the, the the contents of the series and the films changing so rapidly. Every day it is changing, so it is it is uh, you know, it's no more just song and dance. It's no more just uh, you know that that formula uh, films that you get to see. It is about stories. It is about great direction, great performances. Uh, great stories. It's a, a great writing that you, you you see. The writing which is at par with the world and and uh, uh, whatever is happening in the world, in you know, uh, uh, on on OTT. So it's a 
uh, and you know in india all the industries be it malayalam industry hindi film industry tamil film industry they are also becoming one slowly so there are people are making projects where all actors from all industries are working together uh, in in one project so it is the 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 all the different industry is slowly becoming one is also a great sign that that is also happening due to this lockdown were you hoping for a theatrical release for the film or was it purely for it uh, i mean see i mean when we were making it we we were co- completely open about it so we we thought that you know if the theaters come back to normal we'll take a chance of going to the theater uh, first and then immediately uh two weeks after the release will come come on ott but you know again there is an there is again second lockdown second wave came which was far more dangerous than the first one it's a, it's a strict lockdown that we all are living in uh so dial 100 had no chance of releasing in theater but i'm so happy that it has come on ott on z platform and so you've had a very long career and you've never really taken a uh, break from your career so can you tell us how you sustained for so long in this cutthroat industry I mean, do you have any this, advice for new actors i i really don't have any advice sadia all i would say i really thank god it's a miracle that i survived and existed in this industry i've been getting work uh, some success some failure but i'm still here uh, getting work and it's such a great time to be working in Uh, when great stories are being made and told it's a, it's a fantastic time i will i have i only have to you know i have only one thing and that is to thank you all <laughs> i mean it is not really a miracle i mean your your talent of course had a big part in it um ha- have you um worked in bangladesh have you worked collaborated with any bangladeshi directors actors producers anyone I uh, I have never actually worked with them. I mean uh, my director was the writer of one film of mine which happened 20 years back and it was one of my uh, best film one of my best performances also. Uh the film was Ax with Mr. Amitabh Bachchan. Now in this one he's written it and he's directed it. So uh, uh and apart from him I don't think uh, and then there is a cameraman Anuj Dhawan that I have worked with. Uh other than that i have never worked with anybody else uh, uh, you know the siddharth p malhotra who is the producer stony uh, um a uh, corporate which uh, who, who backed us up e- everyone i mean this is the first time we collaborated together uh, okay uh, and um have you ever been to bangladesh oh i want to be there i really want to be there please tell somebody to invite me after yeah, we'll after the it. lockdown and corona uh, once corona is gone and the lockdown is lifted uh, if i'm invited i'm looking forward to my visit to dhaka mm-hmm. yeah so we we saw you in a, in a in a film called uh, chitagang where you played um, chitagang yes the, uh, we shot yeah, yeah. So we shot it in uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah yeah we shot it in northeast uh, bengal mm-hmm. uh, which was very you know the, the 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 landscape was somewhere somewhat similar so we shot there uh, uh, it was a you know very far away place very close to the border burma border and bangladesh border okay and did you learn something about bangladesh well you know playing this bangladeshi character i i i mean you know, i i have read quite a lot i have seen many documentaries yeah. i have seen many films of yours so yeah mm-hmm. okay. and i watch your i and i watch your i, I watch your all all your cr- cricketers Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, great. So your film comes out on Z5 and it's going to be promoted all over the world. And we wish you all the best and we wish the Bangladeshi audience is also like this. So thank you so much for joining. Thank you. Uh, I'm I really request all the Bangladeshi people uh and you please watch my film Dial 100 and watch all my work on OTT. now you don't have to go to theater just you know sit in front of your ott tv and at uh, the, the smart tv and you can watch my films please watch it and send send in your response yes and we'll send you an invitation to bangladesh and hopefully you yeah. please do that thank you sadia <laughs> yeah, thank you so much